and I'm joined by a very, very special guest, all the way from Toronto or Toronto. We got Wave Montega inside. Uh-huh. What's poppin', London? How are you? Oh, see, look, look at the accent. What's poppin'? What's poppin', What's poppin', What's poppin man? <laughs> Isn't it? How are you, sir? I'm good, bro. How you doing? I'm blessed, man. I can't complain. Man. Life is good. Life is good, man. You been enjoying London? So far, yeah. Yeah? A little adjustment, but you know? What's, what's, been, what's been the adjustment? Uh, the buttons to open the doors. Oh, the, the yeah, the, the like apartment doors and stuff yeah, like that. I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. Walking, I'm walking into doors and stuff. <laughs> the, the, the half so you haven't got that in, in Toronto? Nah, we just walk in the door. Like, it's just a in, door. What, in like an apartment? Yeah. Really? I mean, you have like a buzz, but like, even after you buzz, you have to press the button and stuff. Yeah, some some of them are like, like a government building. It's bare locks. Like, some of them you can't even yeah. use the lift unless you got fob. Yeah, that too. Yeah, that too. It's crazy. And then the shower thing, the half shower door we're talking oh, about. Oh, wet rooms. Wet yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, some, yeah. You don't like, have. I first started shower, I was trying to slide it. It wasn't. Going, <laughs> it's just the glass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's and it. Then, yeah. Even like, the driving on the opposite side and all that stuff. Yeah, I couldn't drive out here still. So. You could. You don't think? See, me and Shans have that conversation all the time because you couldn't drive in Toronto. So I promise you, I'll go to Toronto and drive. You could still. I, w- I will go there and drive. I have no problem. You could. Ours makes sense. Your guys' thing is like, <laughs> yo. I'm, it's not that different. It's bro, just I'm watching it and I'm getting confused. Like I'm like. Okay, to be I, fair, our roads are a lot smaller as well. That and too. Yeah, thing thing classes about that all the time. Trust me. But like I said, you're from Canada, from Toronto. What part are you from? I'm from Martin. Okay, where, west where, what is that? West side. West side of Toronto. Yeah. Okay, cool. What's that like? Well, that's what it's like in Martin. Uh, I would say the west end of Toronto is kind of like South London. Really? Kind of. I compare it to that. Like. You okay. Know? That's the most. Like, that's the best I could, I could give it. Like, okay, it's, but it's a lot more uh, multicultural mm-hmm. than London for sure. Well, me and yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. That's the ends that you were in when you were when you were in Toronto. Yeah, well, I mean, because yeah. I thought London was well, I thought it was the most multicultural city in the world. But apparently, it's Toronto. You man got like everything out there. Yeah, everything. Everything. Because like, obviously, London, we've got East Africans, Jamaicans, Nigerians, like all parts, like North Africa, North Africans, like Middle Eastern. Da, 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 da. But apparently, you don't have like. Everything. Everything. You Everything. See, like the, the most crazy mix ever. Like yeah. from this to this and you'll see a mix of it. Like it's yeah. Wild. Yeah. All yeah. kinds of foods, all cultures. Yeah. It's lit stuff. I can't wait to go out there again. Man. I haven't been yeah. there as an adult. Okay. So the last time I was there as a child and I just thought, oh this is nice, this is clean. Just yeah. wait till winter's over. Yeah, because I was gonna go in January and I thought, mm, minus forty. Not a good idea yeah, still. let's let's not really do that. I don't ask you up. Come yeah, summertime. Yeah. Summertime. summertime. Summertime in Toronto's a movie stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no more, bro. What's the music scene in Canada like? The music scene in Canada, it's new. Mm. Not necessarily new, but like to the mainstream, it's new. Right. Like we've been around for a while, but to the mainstream, it's new. I would say like right now is the biggest wave we've had. Good. Um, a lot of people are going to the states and going to like the UK and mm-hmm. going to other places to like further their career because it's not much of an infrastructure as much as it is here right. in Toronto. Right. Plus like a man like me in the UK, like my song translates like mm-hmm. the UK is like our cousin, you know? Yeah, hundred so percent. You guys know what I mean when I when I talk my talk, you guys know how I, what I'm saying. Like yeah, if I yeah, go to yeah. the States it might not translate as, as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like it just depends on like what kind of person, what kind of artist you are, yeah. where it translates. But yeah, a lot of artists are leaving Toronto to go elsewhere because mm-hmm. Toronto's still building. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. That's good though because I feel like that's what kind of had happened to us in 2015, mm-hmm. 2016. There was like a black music renaissance where we were just starting building and building and building. And now, like seven years later, we got people, millionaires buying mansions and stuff. Like that. Obviously, you don't have Drake and Weekend and stuff like that, and mm-hmm. Justin, even though he's not from Toronto, but still, like, you know what I mean? Like, it's it's, it's good that you lot are building that. Now like, you can have like tiers of art. It's not just like the maddest blown. And then, like, but that's what it is right up. now, though. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Okay. It's literally just like that because, right. like, people, I don't know. It's a little. It's different. Like, mm-hmm. I feel like out here there's more love, you know. Mm-hmm. Personally, like when I came out here, there's more love. But maybe, right. it's, maybe it's because I'm not from here. Right. I don't know. Right. So, I hate you, still. I feel like Toronto will, will get to that place eventually. Hopefully, you'll build a culture where you lot can build up new artists that can. Be, make money, make a living off music. Hundred percent. Without having to be like Drake and stuff like that. Hundred percent. Yeah, man. Well, like I said, I always feel like Londoners and Toronto like get on. 
I thought it was because of our Jamaican roots. Are you Jamaican? Yeah, I'm Jamaican. Too. Oh, you speak Patois? Yeah. Oh, I'm so man. annoying. I already know. <laughs> I can't speak, I can't speak Patois. You can? No. You have been to Yad before? No, I have, of course, but I just I can't speak it. I think it's because of your London accent. Like, no, you so know what it different, is? Like, it's my mum. I blame her. I call it like, I blame my mum. She was born here, innit? Yeah. She gets to be Patois. Yeah. But she just didn't she teach didn't me. She didn't teach you. No. Or she didn't, she didn't speak around you? No, not really. Uh, she only speaks around my, uh, my, uh, my aunts and stuff. Like, my mum doesn't, my mum can't even speak Patois, like, at all. Really? Like, so I don't How did you? You learn? I don't know. I just learned. Like I'm, that's what I'm saying. You should know too. Nah, like. no, no. I'm female. I'm female. Let's just talk about it. Cause we got. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we got one of your songs here uh, from your project. We're about to speak about called oh, Frozen, featuring Trey Mission. He's very known over here. Shout do you want to intro it? Yeah, shout out my dog Trey Mission. This one's Frozen, featuring Trey Mission. Alpha Catharsis, my new album. So tap that in. Video. Wave and take is still in the building. Come on. So yeah. that's off your new project, uh, Catharsis. Catharsis. Is it a debut album? Is it a mixtape? Is it... Debut album. Debut album, straight yeah. off the bat like that, yeah? Yeah, yeah no tape before this and just straight album like that? I had a, I had a tape before, a mixtape okay. before it, but this is my first actual like body of work put together as an right. album. What, what made you want to make an album? Um, I had the idea to make it from time still. Like, mm-hmm. from way back, I knew I was going to make an album called Catharsis because like, mm-hmm. I'm not me been through a lot of stuff, you know? Right. Catharsis means like out there for pain and emotion and suppressed feelings so right. I just wanted to put it all into there and just like just tell my story and make the man feel it like mm-hmm. make the streets feel it mm-hmm. it's all, it covers everything like there's love stuff in there there's mm-hmm. the street stuff I love there. the intro by the way appreciate it like that. the Kafasif the actual song yeah. is yeah it's real it's real yeah it's real, yeah, yeah. It's real. Yeah, I really, really do like that, man. Love, fam. I didn't know what the word meant before I heard the project, so I'm not going to lie to you. Still. That's why I had to do the first one that, that yeah. tells you. you know, yeah, yeah, that tells you what it means. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I, yeah I, never, I don't think I've heard the word before. Mm. But um, how long did it take for you to make the project? I mean, unintentionally, mm-hmm. four years. Right. Intentionally, like, like locking in, like, okay, this is the project. I would right. say, like, five months. Right, yeah. Because I've been, I knew I was going to make it from time, mm-hmm. so, like, I was... I was making music like that mm-hmm. for the past four years. I've just been through stuff and inventing, and I'm making it. I'm, mm-hmm. I know I, one day it's gonna be a project, but when it came together, it was like five months ago. I was like, yeah, these are the songs. Mm-hmm. This is how I'm gonna brand it. This is how I'm gonna roll it out. So, yeah. yeah, you're serious about it. Yeah, good man, good, good, good. Now we just played a song with Trey Mission, uh, who's very much known over here. Yeah. Like, how did how what's goat. your last relationship, man? Trey's a gold still. Um, mm. I, I, I met Trey. I would say beginning, beginning of this year or end of, end of last year. Mm-hmm. Um, now that's my dog for real. Like we be in the studio working. Like mm-hmm. even outside of music, it's my dog. You know. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. I hear that, man. Have you linked up with any UK artists yet? Have I what? Linked up with any UK artists yet? Uh, have I? No, I've been supposed to, mm-hmm. but I haven't yet. Who would you? Who would you? Who would you want to link up with? Who would I want to link up with? Mm-hmm. I would say Knox. Mm. Pasalu, mm. um, Tian Russ. Mm. Of course, of course. Those guys are hard. Those yeah, yeah. I, I like. I, I like uh, who else do I like out here? There's so many artists. You guys have so many artists. Yeah, like, we do. We so do many know. Minds, like, yeah, yeah. like I'm missing a lot of them, but like I like. I like the the, the UK scene and stuff. Like, good. I, I'm trying to work with. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Bradshaw extend extend my brand. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So good, yeah, man. Look forward to that stuff. Good man, so that's what's next for Wave, you're trying to just reach out, you're trying to just branch out and branch out, yeah. yeah man. Yeah, it, good, feels, it feels good to be out here and tapping with some of the fans I had already out here and stuff yeah. like that. Like, Sick know. man. Yeah. Have you done the show yet? Nah, not out here. Soon come then. Not out here still. I want to though. Yeah. yeah. So that's what's next then, yeah? yeah? That's it. Ah, cool, bro. Say no more. Hopefully this time while I'm here we could do it though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely, man. Yeah. Definitely, definitely.